Good afternoon, everybody. It is Friday, September 1st, and we are in Schaefer Hall uh, surveying the updates and the progress on the rest on the renovation. Right now, I'm standing in a room that is on the east side of Schaefer Hall, meaning that if you were in the narthex, this was directly off the narthex. You can see the two doors that lead out to the narthex on the north and south. This room we built from scratch. They put up the walls and everything. This is, of the, the Schaefer Hall spaces, this is our smaller meeting space that can either be the size of this whole room together, or you can see here the hardware for what's called an operable partition, which folds up into this wall. It's one of those big heavy duty soundproof walls that you pull out, it rolls, and it can divide this into two smaller spaces. Each space will have a TV for AV, for presentations, things like that. There's room for a counter space for a back. So we could have meetings of, oh, say 12 to 15, or a meeting of 15 up to 30 or so in here with tables and chairs. So this is a great space for some new meetings. Out here in the main space, it might be a little loud because they're shot back in here right now, but as you come out to the existing space, of course, you can see pretty much where the cloud ceiling is going to go, just below the ductwork for the new HVAC. That'll have new lights in it, new speakers in it, the projector will be up there. You see up there they maintained the old fire loft wood uh, to keep the look of the vaulted ceiling. So the windows aren't covered, the lights that hang down provide great lighting over there. This space is the much larger space for, you know, 100, 115 up to that. Coffee and donuts, funeral meals, big presentations that we don't need the entire new gym for, but could be in here. We'll have a projector onto this wall up here, so a nice big screen. Mass overflow like we do for Christmas and Easter would be in here. Anything along those lines. So it's dusty right now, it's kind of dirty, but they're getting it. They're getting it all cleaned up, they'll get it painted, it'll be looking great. Over this way, Over this way we have what used to be PE and CYO and some um, like, like funeral meal service storage is being converted to table and chair storage. So all the tables and chairs for this space will be able to be over there. Most of the time it would stay set up, but we would be able to have the flexibility to clear things out, move things and things like that. There's a staircase over there that goes upstairs to the mechanical for HVAC as well as just a bunch of storage up there, which is great because we always need more storage. Finally, you see back in the corner back here, the kitchen, which is where it always was. That kitchen right now is pretty much shut down, but we are getting a new vent fan in there. We're gonna be getting new ovens, new refrigerators and clean it out because it, it just needs some, some clearing. It's no longer the concession stand. So all that stuff will come out and it'll be devoted as a kitchen, particularly probably most commonly for funeral meals, but also then for smaller meals that we have in here, uh, luncheons or anything with a the presentation, they'd be able to serve out of the kitchen right over there. Um, some people were asking as far as timelines, this, this building, the Schaefer Hall renovation should be done shortly before our 75th anniversary and dedication. So sometime before the 30th in the next few weeks. There are some things that were not included in the cost that we were able, because we had pretty much hit our limit of the Archdiocese giving us loan credit. So some things that we'll be doing as soon as we can with parish funds or with through you know further generosity from people. One is the floors. The floors will be cleaned up obviously and they're perfectly functional as they are now, but we do not have the cash to be able to do much to them uh, within the project. So on our own, we'll be deciding probably walk off carpet in those rooms, some sort of vinyl or something that even if there's an option to paint this so that it looks better. We're gonna see the old gym lines for a while, uh, which will be a reminder to us that we need to do something to make the floors match what we're gonna do with the paint schemes and things like that. The kitchen is also something that we'll be doing on our own as far as It'll be, uh, we have a very generous parishioner who is gonna uh, do the work on the vent fan, that the, the hood fan that goes over the ovens. And then we'll be doing some purchases of new ovens, new refrigerators, freezers, counters, things like that to clean it all up. So those will be our projects when this is finished. Cloud ceiling is the last big thing to go in here. So that'll be great when we get to see that. You can see all the wires that are gonna hang it from. So this place is coming along. On this Friday afternoon, uh, September 1st, I would imagine in about two weeks, we'll be seeing a lot more of the nearly finished project here in Schaefer Hall.
So thank you again, and stay tuned to our channel for more updates.